fact that he had no genre just showed the broadness of his own musical taste and exploration, fearlessness, things like that. I mean, he was kind of off the map when it came to, to genres, you know, rock, country, folk, all that stuff. People really branch out and do all kinds of different things without worrying about what box they're gonna be put in. I mean, I think that's what it's about anyway, what real music is about. I think if you're aiming for something, you're never really gonna hit it. But I think if you're, you're just staying true to yourself and being broad, uh, just being fearless, you know, that's, people feel that. His songs, to me, felt very genreless. I've come to understand that, you know, not committing fully to a genre and going deep into it and digging your heels in is a really beautiful way to maintain and establish yourself as a true artist, and he is the quintessential true artist. A lot of people for many years thought of him as just a country guy, and a lot of people are ridiculous about country music. They think they're not, you know, country artists are not as sophisticated as other artists, and it's total garbage. Johnny Cash was one of the most sophisticated citizens of the universe you'll ever meet. His home was lined with more books than any of us will ever read. I don't think there ever will be another Johnny Cash. It's like saying, is there a modern day Bob Dylan? There's really not, you know. I think Cash is an anomaly, a pillar in American culture. Everyone can get close, but no one has it. Great singers, you know, there's a stamp. A million people imitate Elvis and Frank, but there's just something that comes from the soul that is imprints it forever. We live in a time when artists may only have 15 minutes, but the artists who have, you know, 15, for 50 years making music, they, they share their whole journey. I was working on a Johnny Cash special and someone rather high up in the production, I had written a line in the script about Johnny's connection to rock and roll and he said, Johnny Cash has nothing to do with rock and roll. I was like, well, f you, he does. You know, it's, like... it's, it's few and far between these days that you even see artists that are, that are as broad and daring and powerful as him. I think of him more as like the greatest folk artist of all time because he, and in fact, this series has continues that folk tradition of like using songs to communicate and carrying on a tradition and like commenting on that tradition. So, you know, Johnny's gone, but we're still talking about his songs. And that's the definition of folk. It's like, just pass it on, you know, share stories. And that's what Johnny Cash did, you know, really, really well.